Okay, I, I made a few of these um, suck screen forms. This one is a hummingbird, and it didn't turn out as good as I'd like it to, but I can still use it just by tracing over, and you can see I've tried it three times to get the, the paint to go through it. I also made mushrooms, and I didn't turn out either as good either. Um, I think I just didn't leave it out in the sunlight long enough, and I did it in March. So maybe if I did it in the summertime when the sun's hotter, they say you need to have it in direct light, and that would work better. But anyways, I do have something for the hummingbird. Oh, three three times a charm. I did get a bit of an outline with it, so I, I might be able to use this. I think I'll paint in the rest of it, though. Now, these two flowers that I'm making, plus the flower that's on the dish, it's I bought this, this pre-made one. So, of course, it works properly, and I've got yellow on there, and I've put a couple yellow flowers on this plate that I'm doing. I put a purple flower or pink flower in the middle of it. So I'm just get it lined up and I have to push it down quite a bit. And then what I'm doing, I find this best if I take my finger and push the paint through with my finger. Some people use a squeegee, some people use a sponge, but I'm having quite success with just using my finger. Now this rooster I did, I did a few chicken things in the rooster one. It turned out quite okay after I got the paint on there I filled it in with colored paint and made a funky rooster on here but I'm quite pleased with the way that one turned out and this is one of the ones that I let sit in the sun to burn it off with a design on it there I've got it finished thanks for watching the video